So in the tutorial, there's this one part where it tries to say, get combat advantage and hit your enemy, uh, you know, to continue. And so basically then you see two little ads show up and you are supposed to stand behind one of them and he won't clear until you can see how there's a little blue thing. See how there's a little blue thing, like that white thing there around the dummy here goes blue. My scorpion is really making it difficult for me to maintain that because he, uh, at this point. Now, it's a, there's a reason for that because when you look at your statistics, when you look at your stats here, combat advantage, as you can see, actually has a stat. This particular stat means that this percentage will be added on to your base damage. So if the blue is on, you automatically get this. If the blue is on, this is added to your base damage. So you will do more damage, right? By whatever that percentage is, if you stand in a position where the indicator on the enemy is blue. It's that simple. That's why they talk about combat advantage. Now, you can be in combat advantage as long as you and or your party member or your companion put you in a situation where it is blue where you're standing. If it is not blue, you are not getting that damage. <laughs> so, it, so then it, it, it behooves you. Like, see here I'm standing blue. It's because somebody went up and stand. Oh, thanks, Pinky. Thanks, Ariel. So you can see now I'm blue. So if I hit, I will do 60, whatever. This damage modifier will be added on top of my base damage. That is the purpose of having combat advantage. Because it allows you to make more, do more damage. Main, if you want, the easiest way to increase your damage in this game is literally stand like so that you have combat advantage against the enemy. That is the purpose. Now, coincidentally, if you happen to be standing behind like an enemy and be in blue damage, like being a blue damage thing, you have two things going for you. One, you're not going to get hit in the face by the enemy, right? So you're not going to take damage and you're going to do more damage. Again, combat advantage, even for a tank, if a tank is looking at having losing aggro, Combat advantage is a way to enable you to have more, like to have more damage. Like, so that would give you by default more aggro, right? So if you're a tank and you're finding that you're losing aggro, it's not that you're doing shit damage, you probably are. It's the fact that you don't have enough combat advantage in place to also, you know, aid in your aggro mechanic, which Basically, the aggro mechanic is more damage you do, the more aggro you have, right? 